Hey guys, welcome to another New World video. Well guys, I'm back. Thank God. Everything is up and running. We're good to go. Now, I had hoped to post some interesting video about something with a lot more exciting ideas and information, but sadly, there is something that's cropped up that simply I have to talk about. This is because I've been getting many messages and comments on videos about target fishing, especially since the medley fair drop. People have been asking me what's going on. They're no longer getting X fish in X zone, and have things changed? Well, with some testing when I got back online, I will say unfortunately yes. Things did change significantly with the addition of the medley fair. And sadly, as tends to be the unfortunate theme of New World, the change was not for the better. So, let's talk about what exactly has changed. So, once again, they have redistributed the fish. Maybe this was intended distribution all along. Who knows, really? But, with fishing, again, it's gonna suffer. First, I will say, before we get into the zone-by-zone zone breakdown, there is no longer any way to single target any fish. Not really, even uncommon. Which really is a bummer. But the way they have redistributed everything, coupled with the new loot tables, will make uncommon fish quite difficult to target fish. So before we get into my opinions on these changes, let's first just cover them so that we know exactly what we're dealing with here. So in Cutlass Keys, for uncommon fish, you'll catch large catfish, large tadpoles, medium catfish, medium tadpoles, and small snails, and small catfish. Notice it's snails and catfish for smalls, not tadpoles. In weavers, you'll catch large snails, large sturgeon, medium snail, medium sturgeon, small sturgeon, and small tadpoles. So really, weavers is now probably your best bet for green targets for sturgeon. And in restless, you'll catch large catfish, large tadpoles, medium catfish, medium tadpoles, small catfish, and small snails. You notice that again? And in Restless Salt, you'll catch large clams, large squid, medium clams, medium squid, small halibut, and small squid. You see, the halibut is there as small for no real reason. In Morningdale, you'll catch large catfish, large sturgeon, medium catfish, medium sturgeon, small snails, and small sturgeon. Again, the snails slide in. In Evanscale, you'll catch large catfish, large tadpoles, medium catfish, medium tadpoles, small catfish, and again, small snails. Again, you see they throw in a random uncommon in the small category. In Reekwater, you'll catch large snails, large tadpoles, medium snails, medium tadpoles, small catfish, and small tadpoles. In Brimstone, you'll catch large catfish, large snails, medium catfish, medium snails, small snails, and then small tadpoles. Anyway, I won't go on further reading these loot buckets but I wanted to cover some to illustrate the issue they have created. The complete list with all the rarities will be posted on my Discord. But what I was trying to make clear here is that they have inserted an incorrect uncommon fish in every one of them. And in most cases, they did this with the rares as well, into every zone's loot bucket. What this does is then split the potential uncommon or whatever you're targeting into three potential instead of two or even one. This makes the odds of catching things like sturgeon, snails, or whatever complete dog shit to be frank, and is simply stupid. And even worse, the saltwater in Eden Grove, Brightwood, Great Cleave, and Shattered, those zones still have awesome loot pools with very targetable fish. And yeah, I know what you're thinking right now. And that's the dumb part. There is no saltwater in those zones, so it's completely useless code with no purpose. And in Everfall, yeah, it has a small patch of saltwater in the old starter zone. But if you catch an uncommon fish there, well, something unique will happen. Well, there's none in the bucket, so you'll simply get stuck in the casting animation and bug out. So yeah guys, that's where we're at. Fishing is once again in a bad place. Sure, you can catch lots of legendaries, which in the end makes them feel, well, not so legendary. But all of the fish we actually want, those are going to be harder than ever to catch. I have no idea why they decide to change things like this. To me, it makes just no sense. They add a whole whack of new cooking recipes with brimstone that no one can really make because the value of fish row makes them just wasteful to use. They add seven new chest types to the fishing pool in an attempt to make them more diverse and exciting, but then make it almost impossible to even catch chests reliably by shrinking the roll window. Then they add a new crazy 15,000 luck bait that in order to even make, you need to get extremely lucky, more so than even getting trophy materials from chess runs really, and get pheromones. And in the end, what's the purpose of this bait? Oh yeah, to catch more of it. It has no real value in terms of fishing in and of itself. It really bums me out, to be honest. I really enjoy fishing in this game, and it has the potential to be one of the most exciting and fun aspects of the game. But they have just completely shit it with this patch. At this point, they might just as well remove it, to be honest. Anyway, I don't mean to make my channel a fishing channel, but it's an area I've interest in personally, and they've been really messing with it lately. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.